hey guys welcome back to the channel my name is Hitesh and I'm back with another tutorial and in this one we are going to take a look at the interactive and close simulation in Maya so I have already made some tutorials on and close simulation but today we are going to interact an object with the simulation and try to get some different results so for this I have taken the plane and I'm going to go to FX go to end cloth and i'm going to create this a passive collider so when we run the simulation our object fall on this plane and doesn't get through so i'm going to take a sphere for this part and uh, i'm going to increase the radius something like this and also i'm going to increase the subdivisions to something like this and i'm going to do one more thing i'm going to go here and if you go to cache playback i'm going to turn this off and set the playback speed to play every frame now i'm going to select this again go to end cloth and create end cloth and if i run the simulation now let's see what happens so it's slowly coming down and when it falls on the plane it's going to change the geometry so now our sphere is interacting with plane but i want to add one more object and interact that with this sphere so what I'm going to do is I'm going to just go to this end claw shape and change the pressure to something like 0 0.4. and you can see that it's not completely flat down so i'm going to go back and i'm going to take another sphere pull this up and scale this a little bit like this and what i'm going to do is i'm going to go here and cloth and create a passive collider and now what i'm going to do is i'm going to go here select this go to field solver and i'm going to click here interactive playback and as you can see that our simulation has started so let the sphere touch the plane first and now i'm going to bring this down and it's going to interact with the bigger sphere and create a shape like this So you can bring this down and it's still going to interact with this other sphere. I'm going to stop this, go back. And I'm going to select the end cloth one. I'm going to select this and let's change the pressure a little bit. And now let's run. And I'm going to select this again and go to field solvers and click on this interactive playback.
and I'm slowly bringing this down to interact with the bigger sphere. Now you can create a beanbag type of shape with this. You probably need to change the pressure. So I'm going to stop this, go back, select this sphere. And increase the pressure to something like 0 0.6. And again, I'm going to go here and run the interactive playback one more time. Slowly bring this down. And you can also scale this if you want more volume like this. So that's it that was the exercise and uh, i hope you enjoyed this tutorial as well and if you did then make sure to like this video and subscribe to the channel if you are new and if you have any feedback then do let me know in the comment section i'll see you in the next one thanks for watching